sweet. And like, I don't know, maybe see, I, I, that's something that I've kind of debated with, with myself about is whether or not I should make a new character when I go through and do something like, where like, I, cause I want to, the, the, what I really want to do, is, I don't want to be a renegade, but I do actually want to romance Garrus, which you can only do, you can only romance Garrus if you start romancing him in Mass Effect 2. And on this walk, this time, when I'm playing through Mass Effect 1, I'm romancing Caden, and in 2, I will be, perhaps obviously, if you've seen my other walkthrough, I'll be, or my Mass Effect 3 walkthrough, I'll be romancing, um, Thane. Because he's the love of my heart, and Garrus is like, the, like, the friend of my heart. I don't know, it sounds cheesy, I know, I don't know, I'm just a cheese ball, but, um, yeah, it would be, I, I, I've heard the, ro the Garrus romance is actually, really rewarding in his own way. It's really funny. Like, and I, I could totally, like, romancing, I, the only other person I'd want to romance besides Thane would be Garrus. I mean, it'd be kind of interesting to see, like, if, if you romance, if you stuck with Caden throughout the whole thing, what, what would happen. That's something else I want to do. So I have at least three other playthroughs that I eventually want to do. Um, two other playthroughs that I want to do that I'm like, um... Should I make a new character, or or should I uh, you know, just stay with this one? Because this is the one I like. I spend a long time working on her, and I really I like the way she looks. Like I and I like her personality. And ugh. everybody, chill out. Stop being in battle mode. I got. We gotta save. But. Like, I couldn't really see... Like, it, it would be weird to see Garrus with somebody else besides this character, but it would be weird to see this character with anybody besides Thane. So, or Caden. So... So it's a little weird, for sure. Uh, look at this guy. Hacked. And this one. Oh, come on. Good god dang. Uh, whoa, come on. Ah! Uh, immunity. Launcher drone. Oh boy. Boy howdy. Now it gets fun. Now it gets fun. We better be where. God dang, where are we? Uh. Monk, 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 monk. Ah. Uh, send us all the way back to the core the second one. Lame. Um, too lazy to edit it out. Golly. 
Look at all the all the oxen free. Oh wait, there's still more. Oh, crap, wrong button. I didn't do like anything to you. Uh shield. Immunity. Good, they got it. Okay. Ah, oh, this is fast. Let's do this. Switch to the shotgun. Uh, let's save. Jeez. At least we don't have to do the battle again. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Sorry. I'm probably not gonna cut this out, even though I should, cause I'm lazy. Expedite things when I'm editing. <laughs> There's a couple I know that I have to make sure to edit stuff out, but other than that, I just kind of check them and then maybe let them run a little bit. But I know for the most part that there isn't anything that needs to be checked, and it makes things go a lot quicker. And I don't have to spend a whole day editing, which is okay, but then I get you. Know, I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to get up and walk around. I don't have to go back to school though. I've graduated, so it'll be it'll be nice to just kind of sit down and like make sure like I get, get get kind of a gaming schedule going where like where I play the games and I edit them. You know, like there will be some sort of like up when I upload them to the YouTube to the YouTube. Whoa, what the heck? to YouTube and also for me to like, you know, I'll spend like Mondays playing Mass Effect or something. Tuesdays playing Fallout or something. I remember there was a data port in one of these. Or did it, did it already count that we got it? I guess. I don't know. Boop boop. Uh, are we, okay, we'll save here. But he does. Cause look what happens. You get to the last one and you're like, oh, I don't need to worry about it. I haven't died once. And then you're like, die three times. You're like, oh, great, cool. Let me just go all the way back to that again. Come on, you can't fool me, game. That's not actually a faster run. It is lame. It always amazes me that like Master Chief and like these trained warrior types, they just, they. They don't have any stamina. I'm like, you, you'd think, like, I mean, that's what medieval knights did, too. Like, they had to train to have stamina in, like, 50 pounds or more of armor. So, it's like, it's like, what? Or maybe we're not in battle right now, so I will save again. I just don't know when it's gonna, like, when it's gonna be like, you're in the middle of a battle, so I don't want to, like, mess it up. Okay, I had to stop for a bathroom break there. Let's get out of this vehicle. The thing is I'm like, I won't edit these things out. And then I really have to pee. So, um, let's see. I did a couple. I'm trying, sort of keeping track on stuff that I'm, the, the abilities that I'm using. And I'm kind of guesstimating more. It's like after a mission, I'm like, well, maybe... Maybe I I think I'm like I remember using this one a couple of times and this one a couple of times, you know. Yep. See now we're in battle technically, so it's not letting us save. That's going to save right outside the facility, so that's good. Um, we need to hack the rocket drone. And let's the. Uh, Throw that one. 
Running around in circles, hoping for the best. Uh, we don't. No, we don't want to hack that. We want to hack that one. Uh, come on, blow up. Uh, I need to kind of stay in these barrels for cover. taking a long time. It's okay, we'll break up the missions that I've done before with missions that I haven't I'm done rough. before, which is the asteroid thing. I might, what do I have right now? I have the shotgun on. I think I'll, I'll go back, well. <laughs> Negative contacts, let's save while we're in here, jeez. In such an extensive experience. Alright, let's try to get that guy. Where's the drone? Where's the drone? Uh, oh, Kelly. You have immunity. I'll take some too. Okay, I can jump from fighting to the securing a crate. I don't even know what I was. I accidentally pressed too quick. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, so many things I don't want. This is the last one, though. Oh, wait. There's... Oh, God, there's still a rocket drone in here somewhere. Oh, is it one that we hacked or something? Um, let's do overload and throw. Okay, okay it is sitting right there. Oh, snap. You're gonna kill me. Okay. I was like, I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. Can we... Oh, good. Let's save quick. I don't even... 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We're destroying so much Alliance property right now. It's ridiculous. Switch to the shotgun. It is kind of annoying that these have to be open like this. It's like, hey, don't we have automatic doors? But I understand it's for security purposes. Good, more drones. Okay, well, can I? Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, they, they're in the other room. They're not coming down the hall or anything. Okay, but we saved right after the other one, so that's good. Uh, let's hacky hacky that one. Community. Shoot it! I'm like hitting it to death. Oh good, that went faster than I thought. Central core or anything. Oh, a burst of white noise over 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 all frequencies near the death and so you your heart suits heads up display is interpreted as a series of zeros and ones. And they repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final VI cluster flicker and die. If I knew code, I would knew I would know what that says. I could probably oh maybe I'll I'll have to look it up. Let's see. Um Look up AI or VI. It's it's a rogue VI, I guess, isn't it? I just keep assuming it's AI, but it's not doing anything. Look up VI code meaning. Uh, specialization class achieved. Specialization class will replace your base class and the talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to your squad screen to view the bonuses you gain with each rank and. Didn't I already do that? Oh, it's so quiet in here. Okay, uh, I do not see any. Okay, well, I think I did level up. Oh, hey, I passed level 50. Did I already know that? I don't remember. Yay! <laughs> I don't remember noticing that. Yeah, I think it was, uh, it was this. You could, um,. You could choose between commando, uh, I don't know why I chose this one. Oh, because it increases damage to all weapons. I think, I don't remember what the other option was, actually. I don't remember. Um... I'm gonna go with that, and then I'll do assault training next. Uh, hmm, okay. Uh, let's do, um, hmm. I do kind of want to increase throw. And for Tali... Uh oh, such down enemy weapons shuts down enemy shields. <laughs> I guess there's no more upgrading on electronics or decryption. It looks like damping. Uh Oh. Wow. 
maybe I should work on that one. Okay. Uh, looks good to me. Ah! Shoot, I got a ton of stuff. Okay, wow. Holy crap. Holy crap. Uh, or is it just going through them all again? I... Uh... Um... I don't have to get rid of all of them, do I? Am I just filtering? I'm not. Jeez, where did these come from? crap like I don't even know. Like, where does it end? I just want to be done. God dang, I just want to be done. Okay, take all now. Jeez. Oh, God, the inventory is such a pain in this game. Ugh. I just need to go sell. I just need to go sell things. Ugh. Alright. Well, we completed. Completed our mission. We'll go tell Hackett. And then... Hopefully be on our way to the uh, asteroid. This mysterious asteroid that I think is part of Bring Down the Sky. It's a cool name, Bring Down the Sky. It's like... I am tired. I might have to crack open another soda pop. Give myself a coma. Sugar coma. I only drink full sugar coma soda. Well, moon, earth, it was good. It was fun. It was really freaking long because it had three parts to it, but only suitable for the moon, right? Gotta make the moon extra cool. It's too bad we don't need tracks. Like, that'd be kind of cool. Like, in, on all the planets, you know, it'd be kind of cool. We could, like, leave tracks and then cross our tracks every now and then. Maybe they'll do that in Mass Effect 4. It's just a little thing. But, anyway, thank you all for joining me on this extra long episode where we visited the moon. And saw our good old sun. Saw our good old planet. And now, we're gonna move on to bigger and brighter things, I think. <laughs> Yay! Uh, so thanks again for joining me. I will see you in the next 